lie on your knees before this Hebrew, Autolycus? I encountered him before, Gracchus. Beside the well of Jehoshaphat. What manner of man? He's a priest of the Israelites, despised even by the other priests. No. On yesterday's march, punished by the dust of the road, I sought to drink first at the well before the slaves in my charge whose thirst was far greater than my own. A Roman drinks before a slave. This man was giving water to all. He saw no Roman, he saw no slave. He saw only men, weak men, and gave succor. He saw suffering, which he sought to ease. He saw sin and gave love. Love, Atelicus. He saw my own sin, Gracchus, and greed. But in his eyes, I saw no shadow of reproach. I saw only light, the light of God. You mean of the gods? I do not, friend Gracchus. This Hebrew is the son of the one God, the God of this far-flung tribe. Why shouldn't God's anointed appear here among these strange people to shoulder their sins? Here, Gracchus, in this sun-drenched land, why should he not take this form, the form of an ordinary man, a man bringing us not the old truths, but a new one? A new truth. A truth beyond the truth that we can see. A truth beyond this world. A truth told not in words, but in light. A truth that we could see if we had but... If we had but... Heart! Heart! Faith! Have but faith! Faith. Faith! Again. Isn't it? Uh, they changed it. Oh. Yeah, most of them, man. <laughs> All right. All right, hang on. <sighs> hang it pad down. I'm sweating like a pig uh, in this thing. Son of a. <sighs> Bless me, Father, for I have sinned. How long since your last confession, my son? Oh, it's been, what, 27 hours. It's really too often, my son. You're not that bad. I don't know, Father. I snuck a cigarette or two. I didn't make it home in time for dinner. And I, uh... I struck a movie star in anger. 